Welcome to DNVGL's inaugural energy transition outlook. The way we produce and consume energy is changing. By 2030, the world will achieve peak energy, with consumption levels reaching a plateau. At the same time, the link between global GDP growth, energy use, population, and CO2 emissions, all of which have traditionally gone hand in hand, will split. At DNVGL, we serve both the fossil fuel and renewable sectors, providing us with a unique position to provide an unbiased analysis of the global energy picture. So here is what our analysis is showing. Renewable energy is redefining the energy mix and will account for almost half of our energy needs by 2050, led by wind and solar power. But fossil fuels will remain important, with natural gas becoming the largest source of energy supply. Oil, though, will play a less prominent role, and coal use will significantly decrease. Improved efficiency is fundamental to the flattening of humankind's use of energy. The wider application of electricity will be vital. Take electric cars, for example four times more energy efficient than vehicles with combustion engines. Half of new cars sold globally will be electric by 2035. And what will all of this cost? The world will be spending less in relative terms for its energy in 2050 than it does today. All of this means there will be much less CO2 emissions, but to avoid breaching the two degree limit, extraordinary climate action is needed. So what does this mean for you? Join us in exploring the energy transition and its implications for your industry at dnvgl.com/eto.